speak. Say something to me. Explain yourself, you coward. I'm speaking to you, you piece of human. What's up guys, Jenny here. Okay, I think we all know the drill by now. Let's go right! Just to piss him off. No! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry! Just behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always okay. putting the story yeah. first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my yeah. lead and you'll be fine. Alright. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Oh wow, the dark's moving me. No! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry! Oh no, okay, yeah, I can't do it. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Can I not, can I not take anything? Can I pick anything up? Can I break anything? I want to break stuff here. Oh no. Coming to a staircase, oh, no. Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's oh, office. Oh no, there's only one choice, my brothers. We cannot choose what to do anymore. Let's just do it. Okay, I'm not serious about that. I don't like this way of doing stuff, you know. This is like dictator. You're not giving me any options. And what if I can't go to the bathroom? Are you serious? I couldn't do that in episode 8.5, I believe. What? Oh, the door closed. And this is where his secretary should be if, if he had one. I can't. Wait, let me see. Face. Punch. Wait, hey. What? Oh, I can't spell anything right now. Oh my god. This room is different. Stepping inside his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley a wondered again? in disbelief who orchestrated this until he saw the door with a voice receiver next to it. Surely behind this door lay all the answers to his questions. And beyond all probability, he knew the passcode. He had seen it on his boss's computer just last week. Night Shark 115. Was this the code to open the door? Would it still work? There was only one way to find out. Stanley had been trained never to speak up, but now he would draw from within himself the courage to face the unknown. He drew a sharp breath and then spoke the code. Okay. Shark Knight 115. <clears throat> Stanley spoke the code. Night Shark 115. He spoke it into the receiver, right there on the wall. Night Shark 115. It doesn't work. I'm sorry, is there a problem? You didn't miss here. I did can't, you? I'm saying. Please speak the code I into said the receiver. It, night shark Otherwise, one, we can't one, get on five. with the story. This is a crucial step. It didn't work! I said it! Also, you're hurting a panda. Okay, fine. You're not gonna do it. But you know what? It's pretty humiliating to bring you this far, only for you to suddenly decide you have better things to do. I asked you for this one single thing, for your respect. I did the it! The kind of respect Stanley shows for his choices. He knows what it means to take a story seriously. I did! If you didn't want to see what I had to show you, then why did you come here? You had a choice, you know. You could have gone through the door on the right. You could have done whatever the hell you wanted over there. Why did you come this way? Speak. Say something to me. Explain yourself, you coward. I'm speaking to you, you piece of human! When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Stanley? Hello? Are you... Is everything okay? Stanley, please. I... I need you to make a choice. What? I need you to walk through the door. Are you listening to me? Can you hear me? Is everything all right? Stanley, this is important. The story needs you. It needs you to make a decision. It cannot exist without you. Do you understand me? Whatever choice you make is just fine. They're both correct. You cannot be wrong here. We can work together. I'll accept whatever you do. I simply need you to take that step forward, please. Choose. Do 
I said Night Shark 115. I have witnesses. I have evidence. I have a video. I need this. I have everything recorded. What is this? So, you hear me? Are you there? Are you listening to this? Hey, did my camera freeze? My camera just froze. Why would my camera Are you there? freeze? Okay. It's okay, I can wait. You need time to decide. Time to make sure your choice is correct. That is the best choice. That's all right. I'll wait for you to decide what's the right thing to do. Take as much time as you need. Oh no. Are you serious? I said night shark. Someone was following Stanley. He was sure of it. If he checked over his shoulder now, he would surely catch them. It was only a matter of time. I... I did look over my shoulder. What are you talking about? Okay. Punch. Face. Oh no, wait. Face. Punch. I... I did everything. How did I get off the window? Also... Okay. Face. Punch. You know, I'm kind of confused. Do I have any more options? When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. But I said... I said night... I said night shark 115. There's no point to going back there. It looks like since I'm recording with the microphone, the game didn't... Why? Why did it not work? Well, anyways, guys, I hope you liked this video. You know, check out every link in the description and stuff. Shout out to Shaskor who told me to um, get these endings and stuff. And uh, that made the intro and outro and everything. Amazing person. Uh, so, uh, peace out and I'll see you in the next episode. Where I'll try to get the confusion ending if that's possible.